since you married your wonderful English Rose and have lived in London for the past couple of years, what do you love about London? <clears throat> um, I, I think one thing I really love about London is also true of New York, I think, which is that actually it's a small town. Mm -hmm. um, so uh, particularly, I, I sort of married into I, I, you couldn't quite call myself a supporter of the Labour Party. Um, I married into the Labour Party. Um, I try to be uh, mostly apolitical, except on my issues, freedom of speech and oh, you're, you're, not, you're your own party. I am my own party. <laughs> <laughs> um, but uh, it's it's a great place to live. I mean, one of the I mean, some of it is really a cliche, but it's actually true. So uh, London is a great place to live if you're doing something global because. Time zone wise, it's great. It's eight time zones to California, it's eight time zones to Hong Kong. And then past that, it's what's out there, Hawaii. And it's not much out there. So, um, and, uh, you know, it's a, it's a very diverse city, very vibrant city. Um, it's a clean city. Um, <laughs> I won't quite call it a safe city, but I've never had any problems. But so. up until London, you were basically a nomad, living in a very nice way. You you were all over the place, living different different states, cities. Would you say London is the best place for you? Um, I lived in New York for a while. I really loved New York as well. So um, my wife and I sometimes consider uh, moving to New York, but I, don't know, I really like London. So. <coughs>